Hi, this is Chong Kim for some more Vim tips. Today we're going to talk about Windows. Right now I only have one window and I can split it by doing Ctrl W S. There's a few ways that I can do this. I could do Ctrl W Ctrl S or colon split. They all do the same thing. If I do Ctrl W O that'll make my current window the only window. I could also split it vertically. Control W V. I can also combine this. So if I do Control W S and then Control W V, I could have both horizontal and vertical. To close a window, Control W C. If I want to move from one window to another, I could do Control W Control W. That'll just go from one window to the next. If I do it again, it'll go to the next window, and it rotates. If you want to move to a specific window, you could do Control W and use your H J K L keys. So if you do Control W J. That brings you down, Control W K brings you up, Control W L, Control W H. If you use capital letters, you actually move the window instead of the cursor. So since all these windows are the same, let me bring up another file. If I want to move this window to the bottom, I could do Control W Capital J. Control W capital H will move it to the left. Control W capital L will move it to the right. If you want to resize the height, you could use resize. Resize plus 10, and that'll increase it by 10. You could also do resize minus, it'll subtract 10. And you could also do resize to 10, and that'll make it the height 10. If you want to change the width, that's vertical resize minus 10, and that'll shrink it. And you can also do the same thing with the plus. If you want all the windows to be of equal size, you could do Control W equal and everything will become the same size. If you want to find out more, you could do a colon H caret W and that'll bring you to this index page for Windows commands. So if you go to a specific tag item and do control right bracket, it'll bring you to that entry, and then control T will bring you back. 